Good morning, everybody. It is Tuesday. Um, I'm starting the vlog. I can't promise you guys how much stuff I'm gonna be able to video this week. Um, last week, I don't think I, or yesterday, I don't think I got anything. Um, it's it's an emotional week. It's a long week. It's move-in week. Um, tomorrow's my last day in Dallas, so it's just gonna be a lot. But I'm gonna try to get different things. Literally, now I had all these plans, and I'm just flying by the seat of my pants because I have no idea what's happening next. Um, so just stay tuned, and it's probably gonna be a chaotic vlog. Who even knows? Full of tears, but it's gonna be an amazing time. So let's just start the week. Okay, so by the time you guys are seeing this, it's been like two weeks, but um, Alex and Delaney, I don't know if they're gonna watch this, but I promise you, I promise them that I wouldn't put this clip in here, but I'm going to anyways because I think it's really funny. Um, so you guys enjoy this next clip because I literally have no idea what's going on. This probably isn't gonna go in the actual vlog, but this is just Please for us. Don't. Here's the three bears. These are Delaney's featured children. Here this is a resemblance. And here's. <laughs> and there's <laughs> the sparkling grape juice. We wanted to be fancy, and and think about the time when we'll be having um. As grandmas, not with. <laughs> as grandmas. <laughs> What if our grandkids get these bears? <gasps> or our kids don't. Our kids are gonna get them. Okay, bye. We love you kids. Bye. So, I decided to go to Dunkin' because they came out with new coffees today. And this is like the cereal one. I don't know. Oh my gosh. That was so good. Of course, that has to come out the day before I leave. And obviously I got a decaf because I do not need it to move despite my anxiety right now. And I have to go because people are looking at me weird. Um, it is the 19th of August, 2021. And it's time to move out. It literally looks like I haven't moved anything out. But a lot of stuff is gone. A lot of stuff is gone. Um, but it's going to be good. We're about to get on the highway. And I will film what I can. But I will see you guys at school good morning or good afternoon private story i hope everyone's ready um because jennifer and i are about to leave to go to school um but i have not driven on the highway for less than like 10 minutes so i'm driving by myself so wish me luck okay so i made it to the two mile mark we stopped at some really cool gas station it's not bucky's but i got a sandwich for later and um a few little snacks but driving on the highway really isn't that bad um but i'm excited so let's get there <laughs> I think um, and I'll try to give you guys a dorm room haul or tour um, we had a lot of trouble getting stuff but we finally have everything I think um, but I'm so excited for you guys to see it so let's go um, so I'm finally back in the car the real feel is 108 and the actual weather is like 101 in case you're just wondering how it is in Arkansas um, Macy and I were taking separate cars because we really want to drive um, we're going to the lake. It is so hot in here. I have to go, but let's do it. And then it's also her birthday, so we're gonna go celebrate her birthday. Um, so I'm gonna make this really short because I made it so long on my um private story. But um, today Washington had leg day, and I was like so fun. Like let's just go. My roommate and I took different cars so we could just like get out and drive because we both love to drive. And I saw I was 35 minutes away. I was just jamming out to my music. Like, it's totally fine. By the way, if you guys, they're probably never going to see this. There's these guys see it. Hey, what's up? Um, 
basically I drove 35 minutes to the lake only for it to take me to this sketchy like one-way drive and I was like uh-uh even though I still went and this car was like coming at me not fast but it was like driving in my direction and I was like how am I supposed to get out of the way for them to go I had to drive into the bushes which was so embarrassing and I mean there's nothing else I could have done but um then I pulled out and I like drove away because I'm like I'm not staying here and then um I my wi-fi wasn't working so the maps wasn't working either um which is really fun really great neat. I literally couldn't call anybody and then the car that I saw earlier like was already parked so I kind of like pulled up to them because they were like waving or whatever and I pulled up beside them and <laughs> my windows weren't going down which I don't know why but I like couldn't get them down and I finally did and the driver was like do you know where we are I was like I literally have no idea only to find out we were all in the wrong spot so we were like 25 minutes away so we carpooled together but um which again probably not gonna see this but if you do thank you so much for saving me because I would have been shooting there by myself um but we made it we made it there but all these small little things keep on happening happening I got locked out of the cafeteria don't ask me how um anyways i have to go inside so i don't waste my gas but i thought you guys would enjoy that little story so i'll see you guys later so it is wednesday now it's the first day of school and i'm wearing my tiger shirt and my purple nikes which are super cute and i got these that i love from Samuel. but i got a poncho and i don't know if i mentioned it in an earlier video but I've been looking for a bazooka bubble gum because I have a frame of wrappers that's really, really cute. I'll show you what it looks like in a minute. But I had to buy a pack of 10. Um, thank you to the Amazon, to the person who gave me the Amazon gift card. But I'm going to go put it in a frame now and I'll be back. Okay, so we know that most of this is like me in the car, but it's only like the place, well, I can film anywhere, but I haven't had time to pick up the phone and film a lot. Um, but we don't. There's a Starbucks on Henderson, which I haven't been yet, which I don't even know if we can. I think we can. But um, we have Duncan um, down the street. And I love Starbucks. I also love Duncan. I think it's really good. But I got my first PSL, which it's okay. I'm not a huge cold brew fan. I'm more of like an iced mocha latte person. But it is pretty good and I got some groceries from Walmart. I must go inside and maybe I'll, kiss. I'll give you an OOTD even though I've literally already worn this outfit. Um, I think the exact same thing in a video before but who cares. Um, so I'm going to go inside and um, also I need to figure out how to fix my car. Um, if you guys remember that story from a few clips ago. Also, I'm so excited to go home um, and see my, my family and um my my sisters and um my friends and just hang out on sonic again and um see everyone for a few days very very soon um so i will end it with that oh also i like to say i like to specify even though i literally it was two seconds ago um which i know i don't even have to say on here because everyone i know well most everybody wants to go not wants to go home but misses their home is homesick I'm very grateful to be here, um, and I just feel like I need to say that I am so, so grateful to have this opportunity to come to this school. Um, obviously, obviously, it's very different moving from a different state with no one you really know coming into it. Um, your hometown friends aren't here, your family's not here, and you're having to, you know, make your own way. And it's, it's hard, it's been fun, and it's baby steps, um, and I don't... I just don't want to make it seem like, oh my gosh, I'm really having a great time. I am. But also just a reminder that it's okay to be homesick. I'm feeling homesick and um, it's okay. I just didn't want it to seem like, oh, everything's fine. Um, it's you're it's okay to feel those feelings. Anyways, I'm going to get off my pedestal and I'll see you guys later. Um, Happy Friday, everybody. I just am leaving five below, which is actually nice to be... Um, in an area that has like real stores so Macy and I just left Target and I stopped by Five Below real quick and I'm about to head back to the 
I was about to say the complex, which is actually really sad. I'm about to head back to the campus. Okay, so it is the first weekend. We're on the three right now. We're on campus, but I'm vlogging. But I won the raffle, well, one of the raffles for a dinner at Crash and Barrel for so I can decide who it's for. Four and four. Oh no. I'm going to Cracker Barrel. He <laughs> yeah, Someone's already won their spot. There's two more left. Two.